So you see how paramilitaries, they have these nested liners, right? Like so. Well, this is my first test, my first cut at uh, uh, creating the pocket for a nested liner. So once this is done, we can test it and see if it fits. Get in there. See the uh, tool paths right there. Pretty tight together. I could probably do a much bigger step over. This is taking a long time. But uh, actually, I think we're done. Done with the first pass anyway. Yeah, once that's done, then I'll uh, try to drop this guy in and see if she fits. Alrighty. Damn, those tool paths look cool. So I used an eighth inch end mill, uh, which is pretty small for such a large pocket. For example, uh, here's an eighth inch ball mill, but just to give you a size of scale. So I'm basically just going eh, 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 eh. I could use a much bigger tool, except the, um, the radius is here smaller than a quarter inch tool would allow. So maybe I'll use a quarter inch tool to rough it all out and then quick finish it up with an eighth inch tool or something like that. Uh, or just change the pockets to accept a uh, quarter inch tool. Make it go much faster. This took uh, almost 20 minutes to do these two pockets, which is, you know, longer than I want to spend. If I have to, or if I don't have to, I should say. So moment of truth. Uh, let's see how well I measured when I measured these things out. I, I don't expect them to fit, but here's open. Okay. Not quite. That's okay. This is, this is the process, you know? You try it, you fit. Try it again, you change. So it looks like we're hitting right to the right of my thumb there. Um, right here, my middle finger. Just needs to be a little bit bigger. Try this one, although it's practically the exact same. Yeah, same deal. Just right here in front of my finger. Um, pretty close. I mean, this one, I've got flush all the way to here. Everything to the right of that is in. Just the, uh, the front of the scale right here. Needs a wee bit more clearance just in that far corner. No biggie. It's easy to change and actually I can modify these to, uh, to show that, or to, you know, to try that. Just write a new code and clean up right there, clean up right there, and then this plate should still be good. And then I am that much closer to having a paramilitary handles done. And uh, for those interested, you know, these are obviously aluminum, but um, boom, yeah, I got some titanium, eighth inch thick, 6AL4V, yo, that should make quite a few handles, don't you think? Paramilitary. Mannix, Hinderer, and then of course my own custom knives. So uh, I got a ton of work in front of me. But boy, that toolpath looks amazing. Love the look of machined aluminum. Anyway, uh, that's it for now. Thanks for watching. Keep you guys updated with uh, Para 2 progress. Thanks for watching. Bye.